Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to bring you a new moon reading. This will be for the 27th, 28th of September. This is kind of like a special edition. The time is almost up. Just so you know. This reading is not sign specific. That means it may or may not be for you. Somebody may kiss a fool. Yin and Yang. This is when opposites attract. Opposites are coming together. This is a perfect match. But it may not look like it. But this is the missing piece. So we do have two people coming together that are meant to be. But it doesn't seem like it. This is a feminine and a masculine. Opposites. This is like an endless, this is an endless love. It's time. It's time for this partnership to begin. To really, really, really begin. Somebody's partnership may be stepping it up to the next level. Or somebody may be coming into a union with their match for the first time. Reflection. Reflection. We're going to read this one. This is reminding me of the moon. All is not as it seems. What you see is not what you get. It may be so much more. Creation. Beaver Moon. Creation. Somebody has created something. Created something beautiful by the looks of things. <laughs> That's not going to work. But we can make it work. We will make it work. We're going to start right here. Almost at the end. 
the the beaver moon. You can create your own destiny. Be industrious. Every create creature on earth creates. You should welcome the process of creation. Save money and time. Have a reserve. There, there is a good reason for the saying, busy as a beaver, for the beaver is truly an industrious, industrious animal. Not only do they create sophisticated architectural lodges, their semi-submersible homes, but they change the course of rivers and waterways through strate strategic damming. They create new environments for themselves and other animals. Like the beaver, we too can create with industriousness and vigor. Everyone is creative, not just those who are considered to be creatives, such as artists, designers, musicians, and writers. We all can be encouraged to think more creatively. More creatively. Creatively. <laughs> To solve problems outside of square solutions, to invent new ways, and to imaginatively break new trails. This moon is the moon of taking action. Our northern hemisphere ancestors at this time would be preparing for winter, as we are. They would be preserving food, preparing skins, gathering medicines, strengthening their homes if they were not sturdy and preparing to move to better hunting grounds if they were. Anyone who didn't work hard at this time would likely suffer greatly. They would suffer for it when winter came. The time to take action is now. Right now. Reflection. Stepping away from others is essential to seeing the truth in all situations. The wolf asks you to be cautious of the people around you and to honor your own personal space, thoughts, and feelings. Sometimes you need to separate yourself from the pack in order to gain perspective and to move on in a direction that benefits you. Brief solitude will bring honest answers. Being emotionally vulnerable and truly honest with yourself, answering those difficult questions and asking where you truly want to be in life, charges you with powerful realizations and understandings. The wolf signifies the influence of addiction, manipulation, and use abuse scenarios. It is important for you to comprehend the root of these patterns and behavior to bring well-being to your mind, body, and spirit. Recognize that these issues may require professional advice. Seek help. You can rise above the negative impact of your shadow side. Understanding your needs can be difficult if you spend too much time listening to other people. Listening to your instincts builds a relationship of trust with your intuition, sensing, senses, and higher self. Right now, the wolf asks you to take time away from others so that you can separate your thoughts and feelings from the influence of other people. Be careful in communicating with others or oversharing sensitive information that is important to you and your family. Steer clear of gossip and holding secrets for others. Reassess and evaluate your current situation. What is your source of motivation? I am now willing and able to see the truth in all situations. I accept my vulnerability. It adds strength to my being. The time is now for you to create the life, the partnership, the unions, yourself, right now. The time is now. Do not let anybody else get in the way. Nobody of what you want, of what you desire, of what you need. You can have whatever you want. You can have the perfect match. You can have the perfect union. You can. 
take time to reflect on your current circumstances. If it's not serving your true soul purpose, take the step right now to go after what is meant to be yours. Those other people that are guiding you, they aren't you. What do we have for the 27th, 28th of September, New Moon? Fortitude. This is actually the Strength card. Perseverance. Strength. The strength to restrain yourself. The strength to let go of what doesn't serve you. The strength to face your fears. The confidence and the courage and the willpower and the discipline. The struggles, the hard work, the stuff that you have been, been through has built your character. It's time to take a break. It's time to relax. King of Cups reversed. Withdraw. Maybe you need to withdraw. Withdraw from the world. So that you can go within and master your emotions. This is a card of mastering your emotions and this is a card of mastering your emotions. If you don't take the time to reflect on how you are feeling, to reflect on what is real within you, you will lose yourself. It's time to remember who you really are. Usually on the strength card, there's a lion. You think about the Lion King. Remember who you are. You may have forgotten. And you need to take time to remember. Eight of Pentacles reversed, not putting in effort, focusing too much on the materialistic aspects of life, losing sight of your soul's purpose. Nine of Earth, you need to remember that your soul is whole. And even though this is the missing piece, you have both the masculine and feminine qualities within yourself. There isn't really anybody that completes you, but you. You must take action to fulfill your own soul. Once you are fulfilled, everything else will come to you with ease. You need to find discipline. You need to find discipline. Don't let your insecurities, your codependent nature, keep you in a situation, seriously, that does not feed your soul. You must take action to put in effort into following your own heart, fulfilling your own heart. If you don't love yourself, do not expect somebody else to love you. Healing your heart. Somebody hasn't been giving their heart at the time of day. And they're losing, they're losing their self. Lose, lose. It's like there's a lack of self-worth, there's a lack of self-esteem, there's a lack of abundance, there's a lack of growth. 
somebody's not happy, it's like they're not enjoying life. enslavement this is the devil break free break free from them addictions break free from the codependency break free from the obsessions break free from your ego take back control of your life remove those unhealthy substances those unhealthy addictions those unhealthy people that are keeping you bound to toxic situations yeah it might have felt good for a minute but it doesn't feel good anymore somebody has allowed themselves to be enslaved to materialism Greed, keeping up with the Joneses, and they've lost their heart along the way. Leave it all behind, the Eight of Cups. It's time to leave it all behind. This guy's heart has been ripped right out. It's like he doesn't even have a heart anymore. His heart is on the ground. Somebody's heart has been ripped right out. Got the hangman here. It's time to accept change. Make a change. Stop wasting your time. Somebody is about to. Somebody is about to make a change. In the upright, this is the master of non-attachment. It's actually better in the reversed. This is when somebody sees the, the light. They've been enlightened. This person has received the enlightenment. They are no longer confused. They're getting unstuck and they're making a move. They're seeing things differently. So I feel like this new moon is going to give somebody a new perspective on life. And what is the most meaningful thing in life? Maybe it's not money after all. Maybe it's not things after all. This is an, the end of suspension. Somebody is deciding to make a move. They are deciding that they don't want to be alone or they are deciding that wherever they're at, it's not really secure. It hasn't fulfilled their heart. And they need to take action. Somebody's about to take action. They are breaking free from some sort of ego or them sh their shadow self or something. It's like they're... It's like they're deciding that they're not going to work as hard. They're not going to put as much time and energy into the things. For a bear, it's like taking a break. Somebody may be taking, deciding, I'm just going to take a break. Somebody may be really going through a time of reflection that gives them the epiphany that says, you know what, it's time. It's time for you to break free from these unhealthy, toxic situations. It's time. It's time to take back control. It's time for freedom. It's time to be free. Be free. Somebody is going to be taking a break. It's like, I need a break. I need a break from this unhealthy situation. There, there could even be a breakup. Somebody has changed. The hangman reverse. Somebody has changed. They're changing. Somebody is changing. Somebody is, could be becoming single. Walking away. Walking away from a partnership. Realizing that you don't make my soul whole. I make myself whole.
Maybe they're in search of the perfect match. And they, and they receive some sort of message, okay? They receive some sort of message through meditation, through reflection, through isolation, you know, that I want something more. I can have the best life. To a bear, this is a painful, stressful decision. This is a sudden change as well. A sudden choice. Somebody has been stalling, sitting on the fence. They've been unable to see the truth. They've been blocking the truth. They've been in denial. They've been blocking their heart. They've been ignoring their heart. Somebody hasn't been following their heart at all. Blocking their feelings, blocking their emotions, being emotionally guarded. But now we have death. Now it's over. Now it's time to release. It's time for change. It's time for a major transformation. Somebody is... <laughs> What's death? The death is an end. They are ending something. Underneath this Eight of Cups, saying goodbye to a dead end. It's time to live again. So I think that there will be a, this is like a sudden decision as well. I feel as that though there, and it could happen, you know, this could, this could be a dead end as well. The Four of Swords, it, it could, this, this could happen at sleep. So somebody, you know, receives some sort of epiphany at sleep when they are asleep that uh, it's like when they wake up, it's time to go. Time's almost up. Is it up? It's up. Just about up. Time is almost up. So time is just about up. By, by the end of the day, on the 28th, I think somebody will have made their decision to end something that their heart was not invested in. It's like their heart was, was it wasn't working, wasn't working for their heart. So this is the end. This is, this is a death, this is a release, this is a change, this is a transformation, this is a transition. Somebody is transitioning from one phase to another. They are coming out, this waiting period is over. Their time of limbo, their time of confusion, done, done, done. It's like they've 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 seen it. They've seen the light. They've realized. They've woken up. It's time. It's time to go. It's time to end this. I can't deny it anymore. I can't deny what my heart wants. I can't deny that my heart has been ripped out. I can't deny the pain that I am feeling. I can't deny that this is over. I, I somebody is giving up. They are giving up on being controlled by greed, addictions, money. It's like this is a big, huge shift. Okay, it's a big, huge shift of perception. Somebody's perception changes. We have Leo. We have Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. We have Capricorn. We have Pisces over here. We have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. We have Scorpio. We have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We have anybody, okay? Somebody is breaking free. from an unhealthy situation, it's time. 
the time is up. Be prepared. Be prepared, okay? Be prepared. Be prepared for somebody basically to say goodbye. Okay? Somebody is saying goodbye. And it's because they see an opportunity. They realize. This is realizing the hey man reverse. It's like they realize. You don't complete me. That's what it is. I am whole. And it's like their soul becomes whole. It's like they realize something deep within their soul. And it's like they find their strength and they find their courage to let go and to face fear and to face even independence if that's what it means. We have somebody here that is withdrawing. They are withdrawing. They're leaving an emotionally disappointing situation behind. Somebody is about to face their fears and step into the step into a new life. Three of water reversed. This is a three of cups reversed. This could be losing a relationship, losing a friendship, the end of a friendship, the end of a relationship. So, I there is probably a relationship that is ending. Somebody's heart has been ignored. Heart has been ignored. Maybe they've been ignoring their own heart. And there's about to be a shift in perception where somebody says, It's over. I mean, the end. Death is the end. The end. This is a new beginning. This is a new life. Somebody is about to start a new life after being in suspension, after being in limbo, after holding on to something that was killing them anyway. Goodbye. So, the 27th to the 28th, we are going to have a ending that is very prominent. This is going to allow you to start over, to start on a new journey. With endings, bring new beginnings. Somebody is going to isolate themselves and come to the conclusion that this isn't what I want and it's time for me to go. So be prepared. Be prepared, okay? Good luck.